Hello everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to my channel and to Friday shopping haul day. So to get us started, I wanted to share with you this Aldi, Aldi haul that I did. It was actually before Easter, but I never got a chance to show you guys. So I know you like Aldi, so take a look at this. In no particular order, I've got some naan breads, some pan au chocolat, there's some carrots, some British free range eggs, some sourdough crumpets. I thought that only um, Waitrose did these, but Aldi do them as well. Some peanut, well, these are like peanut M&Ms basically, but for like half the price. I think they were like 59p. Some ham, this was 179. There's some mozzarella, some cheese coleslaw. I saw this, I've never seen these before. Halloumi burger slices. So they had two ones. They, they had this, which is smooth and tangy, and they also had a spicy one. So I went for this, and I saw these ones as well. Lemon and herb flavor burger melts. I thought that looked amazing. The reason why I got both is they have quite a biggish expiry date. That's like for next year. So, you know, I don't have to use them up as I don't get to go to Lidl very often. These are quite good. I picked up these biscuits and they have Alex's and Paul's approval. They're six in groovy biscuits. Apparently they're very tasty. I wish I'd bought more, but um, I buy them and then I try them out with Alex because there's times where he doesn't like them, but they turned out very, very nice apparently. Got some quarter pounder beef burgers. Got two of these Mediterranean vegetable tarts. These weren't very expensive. They were less than two pounds and I thought they looked delicious. And I got a big pizza. I usually make my own pizzas, but I could not be bothered. And I really fancy pizza that looks really nice. And that was 3 79 And then I was very happy to find white bait. It's frozen. I am going to fry it in my um, dry fry thing. What's it called? The name will come to me. But anyway. I cannot believe I found these, so I'm, I was really pleased. Also found this apple tart. This is also frozen. I'm going to put this in the freezer for those days when someone comes for dinner and you can't be bothered. It was one seventy nine, And then, check this out. It's seafood selection. Nothing major about that, but it has clams, which is very, very hard to find in the UK. So I was chuffed. That was three seventy nine got a big salad there that for, oh, for this salad it was £1.29 I think also got some iced lollies two mangoes 79p for two they are it says ripe and ready but they they look quite hard to me so I don't think they're quite there which is a good thing broccoli and cauliflower florets and then got some sweetener I've got a different type as well I'll show you when I come across it but I wanted to try because the one I have I, I don't really like so yes some choco rice some honey nut clusters and some frosted flakes and then a big bag of crisps for Paul there's 18 pack 18 bags inside and that was 179 which I thought was really good now let me clear this and get the rest out. Sorry to interrupt this Aldi haul, but I wanted to show you a couple more things that I got, completely different, but I wanted to show them to you and they're not big enough for another haul, so let, let's, let me show you. I picked this up in my local garden centre for 5 dollars It's a balloon whisk. I really love the handle and that was 5 dollars Then I also got this for my mother-in-law she got from Alex a coffee mug, a reusable coffee mug, and I thought this would look really lovely as part of, of it, if you know what I mean. That was $1.99. And then in the works, I picked up this dome. I am not going to decorate it with these butterflies. It's not really my style, but I liked, look, it was £3, and it's like a cloche. It is plastic, but I thought that was a really good price, and I really liked the way... It looked, I'm sure you'll see that in my house somewhere. I saw these 3D embellishments, so they open up. I thought these were really cute. Also got this 
for Alex. He tried this at school and really liked it. So when I saw this Spirograph set, I bought that for him. And I also bought him these fake, what they call them? What are the real ones? Hmm, you know what I mean, right? For 150. And then in WH Smith's, they had this Create a Geode Ultimate Science Kit. It's for eight plus, but Paul will do this with him. And this was 9.99. He is gonna love that. And then finally, Fat Face were having a sale. So I got these, this for Alex for, oh, is there the price? It's there, 14 pounds. You can see it written there. And it's like a little jacket slash shirt with a hood. He's gonna look pretty cool in this. Okay, that's it now. Back to the Aldi haul. So here's the rest. I got some mango, dried mango, some toasting muffins, two things of taco seasoning, and here's the other sweetener. I got, like I showed you earlier, I got this one and this one to try to see which one is better. I also saw this Sweet Freedom, always sweet, always natural, chop pot chocolate spread some mushrooms, pilau rice, some chocolate with hazelnuts, some white chocolate and then also some chocolate chips. I want to try and make something with that and then bubbly bite-sized chocolate, some ravioli, ricotta and basil, two bananas, some korma sauce. I've never tried this but it looks really nice carrot and coriander soup, some skimmed, semi-skimmed long life milk and some soya milk and then some half and half. I've never really tried that so I want to try it, see how that works. And finally this glorious Easter egg. It looks amazing. This would be for me to give to Paul at Easter. Now I'm going to show you what I got in Tesco's. I popped in today to get some bits for Alex. I want to show you what I got. So the first thing I saw and I thought Alex is going to love this, sloth pyjamas. These were two for £12 and they are long sleeve pyjamas. There you go. I thought these were really cute. I also got him these little sandals. I don't know whether or not I'll keep them, I'll see how he feels about it, if he likes them. They've got like a camouflage pattern. And then I got him a two pack of shorts, just plain, like navy blue, and these are like gray. They're coming across as beige, but they're actually a gray color. And then I got him another pair of shorts, which is this camouflage ones. So they were eight pounds for these, and th this set of two was 12 pounds, those. And I also got him a Batman t-shirt. Look, it's got like the Lego, this is like a um, 3D, not 3D, but you can feel like the little Lego bubbles. And it comes with a cape on the back. Let me show you. There you go, and it's a detachable cape. I think he's gonna like that a lot. And that was eight pounds. I don't know if I told you how much these were, but there you go, 10 pounds. So that was it for Alex. I picked up these pajama pants for Paul. These, the ones he has are quite thick ones, so I thought something a little bit lighter. 14 pounds and then for myself I just got this top it's a v-neck but the material is really 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 soft and there you go seven pounds I also saw this not clothes but it's like a family rules little little thing and I think this was two pounds it was the last one they had there on in my store but I'm sure they'll have it and Paul pointed out that I if I get bored with the back I could just paint this side and hang it as a little shelf which I really like what else oh I got this 
wax melt, peach and passion fruit. I think they were 60p. And I also got this little bowl. This was £1.25. They had all different colours. How adorable is that? And I've put it here for now, just because I thought it looked cute. I also got some grapes, this tray for £3. And I was very excited to find this. It's UV face, so face cream basically, face sun cream with SPS 50. 0% white residue. I've already had a little try in my hand and it does not leave the white residue and it's very, very light. Six pounds. So if you're on the market for a good one and it smells like Nivea, who doesn't like that? This was promotion for one pound, so I just picked it up. I also got some hair dye and some fragrance booster. This is the Tesco's one. I've never tried this, £2.50. What else? Also got two things of cat food and some cat litter. And that was it. Now, next week, I was tempted to do a clothes haul for myself. Some of you have asked me where I buy my clothes and all that kind of stuff, and I've um, bought quite a few things over the past few months, so, I might do that if you are interested. If you are interested, give it a thumbs up so I know more or less how many of you want to see it. And also, if you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good weekend. Bye.